Hey you guys, it's me, Rachel Ray to lose 77. Okay, this is my second weigh in Wednesday since I've started really keeping track and keeping tabs with this book so that I can come back and tell y'all actual factuals. Okay, last Wednesday, we will switch it on back. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys, bear with me. Um, I literally just walked through the door. I haven't even put my groceries in the refrigerator. It's 127, and I have to get ready to go back to work and drive the bus. So, in order for me to do this, I have to do it now. So, I'm not completely as organized as I want to be. But, here you see what it is I do every week. I mean, every day. I have, this is this is the last Wednesday that I weighed in. It was 276.4 pounds, <coughs> which is a 4.4 pound loss from that Monday, so it was just a few days in between there. Um, I track everything I eat, including calories. I did not work out, so you see nothing down here in the workout page, or the workout part of it. Um, I did buy me this marker, so that I can start, um, whatever the flipping word is, start uh, putting things to where I can know what it is I'm looking at. Uh, you'll see things such as, where it says vitamins, you'll see a check mark by it. I took my vitamins. Um, Sunday, I didn't track I didn't do nothing Sunday, but I didn't really, I didn't eat anything unhealthy except for, I got into some Nutella, I ain't gonna lie about it, but um, that was the only bad choice I made that day, which still, when I added it up that at the end of that day, it still wouldn't have put me over my calorie count, but um, I've been trying to stay 1,200 or below, 1,200 has been the max I've gone, um, but um, I have worked, I have been working out. That is tracked here. The least calories I've burned in one workout is 407.8. I've done closer to 600, 550 or above the other times. Uh, today so far, you'll see, I have not eaten anything that ain't even a lie. I have not done my vitamins yet. It's just been hectic. I said, regardless of what gets done, I'm going to go work out. So I did that, come home, took a shower, and then I've been going ever since. It's not been it's not been fun but um i did do 562.9 calories on the elliptical machine today and i wish i could come to y'all with something fabulous and exciting but keeping it real is keeping it real i was 278.4 pounds this morning that's a two pound weight gain y'all know and by looking back at my videos i don't lie about stuff if i'm gaining weight or not losing weight it's simply because I'm not working out and I'm not eating right. I've had two weeks of eating very healthy, uh, mostly fish and produce, um, a lot of organic stuff. Um, the only two decisions that I've made that were had no real nutritional value, other than I do uh, do iced coffee every now and then, maybe three days a week, um, and I get the 150 calorie um, at Wendy's, the small vanilla iced coffee. Anyways, um, I ate one day. I ate a Rice Krispie treat, which was 150 calories. I tracked it. I even tracked my iced coffees. Um, and then the day that I ate the Nutella. Um, those are really the only bad decisions I've made, and I've been working out. So it is what it is. The body does what it wants to do. I am not discouraged. I know it's going to get better. I would like to say, oh, that's you know, because it seems like when I was younger, that I could just switch my diet just tweak it just a tad bit and I would be um, the pounds will just fall off now that I'm older I guess I'm going to have to work for every penny that I lose but that's fine it is what it is but um, I also am going to tell y'all about my goal my goal is to be below 250 pounds by May the 9th um, it's completely achievable that's uh, 9.3 pounds a month for 3 months plus I have 9 days in May and what we had left of this month um, it doesn't seem like it's achievable in weeks like this, but I know that this, like I said, um, I lost four point something pounds in three days, which most of that was probably fluid. So what I'm losing now is literally going to be fat. So it's all good in the hood. It's going to be okay. Um, that's all I want to say on that front. I bought this book today at, um, Barnes and Noble. I think it's Barnes and Noble. Heck, I don't know. A bookstore. Um. That we have over here it's called um, 400 calorie fix the easy new rule for permanent weight loss and it's really 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 interesting it has lots of um, uh, recipes 
and it explains the reason behind why it's called the 400 calorie fix and I'll get into that once I've read some more of it because now I can give you all a vague definition of what it means but it's not the perfect definition uh, I am going to do a I'm sorry I'm all over the place y'all have to excuse me I am going to do a food haul I went and got some groceries today um, um, other than that I really don't have a whole lot going on I've got my I'm watching Paranormal Activity 4 tonight and I bought me two of these books that are in this series that I love um, Charlene Harris I just got um, on the, I got two pages left in this one and I love these series these are all vampire type books they're cute I like them um, anyways so that's what I've got going on sorry I'm so all, all over the place you guys I am sticking to working out whether I feel like it or not I walk my butt up into that gym and trust me I have did not feel like it today my body is killing me like my um, the back of my calves up high where you would get cramps at and potassium I know you guys I eat bananas um, it's killing me and then I try to keep good posture when I'm on the machine and this area right in here is on fire and I guess that's from uh, you know standing up straight and I'm trying to watch my breathing and all that good stuff because the guy that owns the gym is a trainer and he will watch me everything I do and he'll get on to me about it all so that stuff is hurting this morning I did not want to go in there but I did I'm trying to look up something you guys forgive me um I do have my weight on here I also am going to do a recipe and share it with everybody that um, uh, Banded Wendy um, put on uh, Facebook if you're not friends with her. It sounds like it's going to be divine. I haven't eaten it yet, but I will be eating it. And I want to share this last thing and I'll go. Um, it says the expert in anything was once a beginner. And it's just one of these little clip things. But when I read that, that really, really really hit me because as I told y'all in my last video I really want to be one of those people that love to work out it's just a part of my life it's what makes me feel good and um, to become an expert in that I've got to be a beginner at that and that is what I'm doing right now and I love y'all y'all have a blessed week I'm going to go get ready for work I'm going to try to find me something to snack on some almonds or something because I have not eaten and it's not good but um, I wanted to share a little bit more of my daily like what I'm eating uh, to get tips from you guys but, oh God, let me see. I know, y'all know, I talk so much. But, um, there's days like, um, like I had tilapia and a salad. In my salad, I always put these uh, organic 100 calorie guacamole packs. I half the guacamole and put it in there. Or I will cut up avocado and put it in there. That was a, for that breakfast that morning, I had, it was a weird day. I had a 100 calorie tuna pack and a, a 120 calories worth of crackers, two piece tilapia for lunch with a salad. I ate, um, for dinner, I ate tilapia with squash and onion, sauteed in extra virgin olive oil. Um, here's a day where I had eggs with mushrooms, 260 calories, it was very high in protein. Um, chicken breast with pepper and onion, an iced coffee with, um, and I also later on that night had a banana out of my Yonanas, the banana ice cream thing, if I can get it out. Yesterday was one of them days where I could have done better, but I had albacore tuna with crackers and a baby bell cheese, the light one. Um, it was that, that meal was packed with protein. Um, that night I had a piece of fish, three pieces of shrimp, and this is grilled, um, and green beans. And then I had an iced coffee. The, di the day before that I had Three un eggs sauteed with onions and a little bit of cheese. That was 250 calories packed with protein. I had, that was the day that I had the Rice Krispie Treat because I did not want to eat after that. I didn't eat till like 11 o'clock, after 11 o'clock. I didn't want to eat before I got on my bus. So I had two snacks that day, which was Rice Krispie che Treats and a 100 calorie almond snack pack. And then that night, oh, okay, my handwriting's so messy. I love tilapia, you guys. It's just part of something I love. I had tilapia with a salad again with a the half a pack of guacamole. These are kind of like where I'm at with what I eat. Um, everything that I eat, if I can't track the calories on it, I won't eat it. But that's just that's just an example. I know there's places where I can do better, but it 
it really, really is hard with the job that I have to eat. You know, the lap band is made when you eat high protein food to make you full longer. So I don't want to just cram food in just for the sake of cramming food in so I can get three meals. So that's why I try to do those little snacks, even though I know snacking is something that people frown on. It's kind of what I have to do. I can't get on the bus packed full of food or I'll be miserable. And when I say packed full of food, it doesn't, you know when you're eating the high protein meals, it doesn't take a whole lot of food to make you feel super, super full compared to what it would have before. But I've, I'm sorry, you guys. <laughs> I'm so tired if y'all can't tell. And it's just fixing to get a longer, it's fixing to be the longest part of my day. So I will talk to you guys later and I will be doing a Wednesday uh, I will do, be doing a food haul and I will also be doing that recipe that Banded Wendy shared because it is, I'm telling you, it's going to be delicious. But I will talk to you later. Bye.